truth, I'm going to do some primer. So the primer I'm going to use today is the Pore Professional. Got this from, can you see it? It's kind of bright right now. Focus. 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 There you go. Ow. See, I got this from Ipsy. I think that's what you call it. <laughs> uh, you can get a subscription for $12 a month. It's pretty good, you know, for the cheap one. Then it got, of course, another level and another level. Um, so I'm gonna put this on. I really I like it because it's actually my tint. See, it's a tint color. Uh, see it? It's pretty good. Sometimes they come with bags like this. Let's see. Ipsy. I said it right. Oh, I think. <laughs> so, usually dab, dab, dab. And I start rubbing it in. Put it under my eyes. Make sure my eyes get in there. Because, you know, I don't no dark circles to be showing. You feel me? Get in there, get in there. And all of that is really good um, because it shows less pores, which I got plenty of. A whole lot of. Get in there. Wish it was bigger, but of course, a bag for that you get, you know, five things in for $12. Of course, they're not going to get that big or be that big. Should I say B? B! Edges. Can't miss them edges, you feel me? It just got to be good. Got to be good. Before I even put my primer on, I usually put a sunscreen on my face because you don't want this harsh sun to mess up your skin. Seriously. Do not want that, especially with this Florida sun. <laughs> It'll kill it. Yeah, trust me. When I moved from South Carolina, whoo, the devil was my enemy. Yes, it was. Making sure it's rubbed in everywhere. I'm not missing any spots. You know, you don't want to miss any spots. Get them edges, them edges in that face. Not, not, not these edges, but you know, the edges on your face. Mm -hmm. And as you can see, I don't really have that beautiful skin that, you know, AKA all quote unquote models have. You'd be surprised if you see them before makeup. But anywho, you going to tell no secrets, no secrets. Mm. In there. And I sometimes like to use my green thing. <laughs> Call it my green thing. You know, especially red spots. No, it's a pro corrector on my red dots and stuff. Where it won't show as much throughout, you know, through the foundation. So you gotta get them edges. Get them edges. That edge of the face. Get the edge of the face. Get the edge of the face. Do you want a case? Edge of the face. Edge of the face. Alright. That little bag it. That little bag it. Now you see that little dot dot? 
just a little, you know, just really good. Mm. Mm. Sometimes I like to put it on my lids too, you know, for my eyeshadow to be able to catch oh, right here on the side of my eyeballs because, you know, usually people don't pay attention to that area right there and the edges of my eyeballs. Sexy! Get my green green. Green green on that thing. I probably look that here, that there, you know. Come on. Rub it in. Not really with this because I'll make it even more green green. But I do it with my fingers. Because I still have my little product on there. So about the um, poor professional and it mixes it in so there you go so yeah, 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 yeah. I don't really put that much but you know it's a video Gotta do extra. You know, just wipe it around because sometimes the red is everywhere. So, different locations. You don't want to do your skin too hard because it ends up getting a little bit redder when you rub it too much. Don't rub it too hard. Just rub it right. We're gonna cry tonight, tonight. I'm always trying to get under my neck line right here too because you don't want to be looking too crazy down there, you know. You know, your skin not matching and stuff. It's crazy. Always have some paper towel next to you just in case, you know, get that, you know, try to get one moist, one dry, which kind of didn't get one moist. But it's okay. I got some water around here somewhere. Hmm, whatever. Okay, next foundation. I usually use this one. It, it's great. Matted because I don't want to look greasy. The do one makes me look kind of greasy. No shade. If you do use it, hey, that's your skin. Okay. But mine is oily with a little bit of combination right here in my cheeks. Kind of dry, but yeah, here, here. You know, all over here is greasy. So, um, yeah, that's the one I use. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it, baby. Mm. Lips look a little crusty. <laughs> So, I use a lip sponge sponge, you know. I know a lot of people use all the types of things. I got a lot of things around here that I can use too, but I prefer now, you know. Dab, dab, dab. No, I love to dab. So, dab some stuff over here and on the side too. So, I don't want to, oh, it, ah, uh, it, yeah, it's a little bit more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Try to play me. Oh, oh, oh. Usually I have music playing and stuff, but yeah. Not right now, I guess. Because I'm recording. I don't know. I want you to hear me. See, you're looking so small. You're looking so small. Yes. Yes, it do. Mama. I 
know what it looking like. Why is she dabbing her eyeballs? Because, you know, there's a lot of foundation on the sponge. So you want to try to use that foundation that's on the sponge to get in there, get in there, you know? I'm gonna do get in there, get in there, and I'll be dabbing it, dabbing it while swiping and dabbing and swiping and dabbing. Dab, you know. <laughs> yeah, I'm goofy. Y'all don't know me. Very goofy. Is it my jazz? Get that neck. You want to try to match your face with your neck. Some people don't do that, you know. They look kind of hot mess sometimes. We're not gonna say any names though. You feel me? I like to get my eyeballs too because I don't want my eyeballs looking all types of crazy. Some people don't do that. I do. Okay. Shoot. Everybody has their own way. You find your own way, what you're comfortable with, and you'll get it done. And make sure you get that nose. You don't want to forget that nose. You're doing a purse. Okay. My purse is cool. Do you see? Do you see how small my skin looks? Yes. Yes. Sexy. <laughs> you see me looking behind. I'm also looking at my mirror too. <laughs> I have a mirror in the back. Uh, along with my element light. <laughs> Check out the other day. Woo -woo. Yes. Okay, so now I like to put blush on. Get my blush. I want to put my chapstick on so bad right now, but I do not because I don't want a uh, blush powder or anything on my lips right now. Uh, but my lips are like, ew. <sighs> Where did I put my, okay. Oh, by the way, I'm using this one. See it? It's called Pacifica. It's 100% vegan and cruelty free. Ew. Okay, which I also got from Ipsy. Mm. I like to go a little bit above, you know, and get my cheek, my cheeky, with the the lighter reddish color, this one. Just get her in there, go in there, you know. And as you can see with the angular blush, blush, brush, black brush, yeah, I guess that's the correct way to say it, I don't know. Sure, I've been doing makeup for the longest, but I never got the hang of the brushes thingies. You feel me? <laughs> Like I said, everybody has their own way. Find your way. You know. Mm. Little buff. Get the chicky chickies. Mm. Chickies. Mm. You don't want to overdo it because you don't want to go out there looking like a prostitute. I remember one time, I was very young. I didn't know what a prostitute or slut meant. My mom has so much makeup on. <laughs> now all I can remember is my friends telling me a person who has too much makeup is a slut. And I was like, Ma, you look like slut. I'm all like, what you say you look like? A slut? She's like, do you know what I is? I said, yes, a lady who wear too much makeup. <laughs> Thank goodness I ain't get my hair well done, you know what I'm saying? Whew. She just looked at me and was like, this what? Chick. She almost got it. Whew. Whew. Traumatized. Get that chickies. Get that chickies. Mm -hmm. Okay, next I use the brown with this brush because it actually gives me more of a crease too. What is this brush? Oh! 
don't know what this brush is named, but. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I get in the crease. Mm-hmm. Do you see the crease? Mm-hmm. Creasy, creasy. Yeah, I bring it in. You know? And here, as you can see what I did with my blush as well. Try to go around. Because... I don't want my face looking all white up here and then like black blush. And yeah, they kind of crazy, kind of crazy. But later on, I'll be going with my sponge around, you know, to blend everything in so everything will look good. All right, next I do is my eyebrows. Where is my eyebrow pen? Oh. I put it over here. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'm looking through these things, as you can see. <laughs> I'm trying to put this one over here and that one over there. All right. So, I always use like a little brush thingy. Don't look at it too hard, it's kind of dirty. <laughs> With a whole bunch of, yeah, yeah. Because when I go in there, it kind of fills it in too. I need to clean it though, but ow. I just hit my elbow. Go in there. Mm, sexy. Not finished, y'all. Don't, don't, don't mind me. Bear with me, people. This is the first time I'm doing my makeup and a phone while using my phone. So it's like kind of awkward looking. Try not to make it too dark, which I kind of am. And I just had my. Hold on one moment, please. Please. I'm back. I just had to get my sharpener. Cause I need to sharpen my pencil. Cause we need it looking good. Okay. When we go outside, we look good. To my right and my right. Okay. Uh, fill that in a little bit. I like to use the dark brown because if I use a black um, pen, it looks kind of wild. And it makes it look like mad crazy. I don't want my eyebrows looking mad crazy, you know? It looks real dark and crazy. I'm gonna get a hang of this. Oh, doing eyebrows and makeup in a freaking phone! So I can give y'all some lessons in the makeup that I be doing. Like, you know, one whole bunch in a million women do this anyway. So, why can I do it? You know what I'm saying? I want to do it too. Hey. people ask me, how you do your eyebrows? How you do your eyeshadow? So, so you can see, I'll try to fill it in. Not too dark, please. Remember, paper towel. Always clean your hands. It's looking good. Shut up, what? You can see, I try to blend that all in, you know, with my dirty brush. <laughs> it's only me that uses this away. Don't judge. It's only God can judge us. You hear me? Hey, multitask. <laughs> Bam! 
Vroom, vroom, vroom. You look good. You look good. You look good. I think so. Yeah. There you go. Booyah. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Next. Alrighty. So, to make sure my eyebrows pop, I also put. Where did it go? Where did it go? Hold on one second, okay? Hold on. Okay. This. I always like, it's like a concealer. It is a concealer. <laughs> Illuminating concealer. <laughs> I like to use these with the little brush because it actually gives you direction. You know, and you're able to and all that stuff, so. Bear with me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I blend it all in, you know, to make sure it's in there. But y'all gonna have to hold on. I don't know if I can blend it in with this light like this. And I'm like, ugh. And my eyeballs all in there. So wait one minute. I'll be back. And you see, that's how it ends up being. You know. So and I'm getting a sponge sponge, you know. Usually I use the same sponge because already, you know, it's already blended. Yeah, right, right. But if you are um, a different complexion, I would use